for pre-need funerals, burials, or cremation since 1975. Courteous and Son Funeral Home, Sylacauga, Childersburg. Mrs. Glennie Masters, age 91 of Vincent, died yesterday at Grandview Medical Center. Courteous and Son Funeral Home will announce the funeral arrangements. Funeral service for Sarah Sue Gock, age 70, will be uh, February 22nd at 2 p.m. from Faith Worship Center. Visitation will begin at 1 o'clock, service at 2, Ursary Funeral Home, Talladega Directing. Public viewing for Ira Elaine Haynes, uh, who passed away on Sunday. That public viewing will be uh, on Thursday at Ursary Brown Service Funeral Home in Talladega at 1 o'clock, followed by a service at 2, Ursary Brown Service Funeral Home, Talladega, in charge of the arrangements. James E. Patterson, age 71, died February the 19th, Community Funeral Home, Sylacauga, with the arrangements. Alfonso Stockdale, age 65, died February the 18th, funeral arrangements to be announced at a later date. Terry's Metropolitan Mortuary will announce the funeral arrangements. And funeral service for Mrs. Elizabeth Craig Golden Harris, age 94 of Goodwater, will be Saturday, February 23rd at 2 p.m., from Goodwater United Methodist Church, Dr. Bill Etheridge will officiate burial in the Goodwater City Cemetery. The family will receive friends Saturday from 1 until 2 at Goodwater United Methodist Church. Mrs. Harris died Monday, February the 18th. She was a member of the Goodwater United Methodist Church. She taught school for 20 years at Sylacauga Main Avenue School and later became the bookkeeper at the Harris Corporation. In lieu of flowers, a family request donations be made to the Goodwater United Methodist Church, P.O. Box 32, Goodwater, Alabama 35072. Memorial messages can be sent to the family at radneyfuneralhome.com, Radney Funeral Home, Alexander City Directing. Master Nebraylan Marbury of Sylacauga died Monday at Children's Hospital in Birmingham. Armors Memorial Funeral Home, Alexander City announcing the arrangements. And Mrs. Rosie Brown, age 49, of Alexander City, died Tuesday at Grandview Medical Center. Final arrangements are pending. They'll be announced by Armour's Memorial Funeral Home in Alexander City. These obituaries this morning brought to you by Curtis and Son Funeral Home, the North Chapel on Highway 21 in Sylacauga, and the Childersburg Chapel on Highway 280 in Childersburg, 256-245-4361 for pre-need funerals, burials, or cremation since 1975.